This one, uh, Kakul Seiden is a four man raid, much more difficult than Vikas. I think it's the same. It's just his four man. And if you got like four mans of like this kind of guy, then yeah, you're gonna be stuck right there. Because like uh, finding like eight decent players and finding four good players, four good players are harder to find. So yeah. And if you find like this guy, yeah, you're probably gonna get cucked right there on your like a uh, clown party. So yeah, won't be that overgive for it, so you will get wrecked. And a lot will depend on each player to be skilled and efficient to clear the raid. There we go. At least you know. <laughs> Same story with Bra Brawl Saza. Honing is even harder, raid is much harder, you see the pattern. Actually, honing gets easier in Brawl Saza, because you get a new gear. So it's actually easier. You go you go back to 10% instead of like 1%. Alright, well, anyways, let's go boys. It's ding dong react time. So yeah, first of all, there is this one, I guess. So, Lost Ark will be making an appearance at TwitchCon Amsterdam. In addition to this exciting news, Lost Ark will also be available to players in the Netherlands, which is a bit weird to me. So yeah, is it because like they removed the Yost jar and then they, they can enter Netherlands? But then that's weird as well because like don't you count like a card pack as like, you know, RNG as well, like a, like a box, like a loot box or something like that? Huh, I'm not sure why as well. I mean like the initial reason why I don't think like Netherlands and like uh, Belgium gets it is because like they just avoid doing it. They just like uh, they don't bother like trying to release in Netherlands and Belgium because like of the ga uh, the law over there. Well, I'm not sure what it is right here. So yeah, I'm not sure what's going on. But I mean like there are some things that you can count as like loot box like the card pack if you really think about it. The card pack is basically loot box, don't you think? I wonder how much they paid the government to for uh, there to release the game there. Well, I'm not sure to be honest. I don't know. Maybe like there is gray uh, gray area where they can sneak in. The regulation in Netherlands has a law as a uh, game gambles in game is illegal. Yeah, no, I get that, and that's why I think they were not released to begin with. It's not that like they tried to release and they got denied. I think they didn't even try to release in Netherlands and Belgium. So yeah. And then they removed the US jar, and now in Netherlands it's like available. What about Belgium though? Seems like Belgium might not be like a, a thing. Think the difference is you can get cars in game, but you have to pay IRL money to, for US jar. Except you don't. You can use your gold buy it with blue crystal. Same thing, right? You can use your gold to buy card pack as well. So I don't know. Doesn't France have something against loot bosses? Well, don't know, don't care. The point is basically what we're talking about is like Netherlands. <laughs> well, I don't know. <laughs> Even honing, etc. is kind of gambling. Mm, I guess you can like, uh, you can kind of like put it that way. You know, it's a stretch, but you can put it in a way like that. You also get cards though uh, through quest for free. Yeah, and you can buy like the what's the name, the legendary avatar through auction house as well, without with zero gambling. The point is basically it's still there, right? So yeah, blue crystal is technically uh, still uh, someone's uh, money though. Mm -hmm. And you buy blue crystal and then you buy the card pack from Mari's shop. What's the difference? Isn't yours unlimited gold sink and card packs and shop are limited? Mm, it's unlimited dude. I mean like it's gonna refresh anyway in the next 6 hours, right? Right? Had a friend that played video from Netherlands and all the loot boxes were taken out of their shop. Damn, rip dude. Never lucky. How much of a damage bonus in using elemental will occur later? Honing isn't gambling. Well, it's a stretch, but you can call it gambling if you wanna uh, if you wanna do it basically. So you can call it gambling. You can call it not gambling. That's not the point. That's not what we're talking about. What we're talking about right now is that like it released in Netherlands right now, not Belgium by the way. I'm not sure if Belgium is releasing as well. But I mean like it's pretty late. Wonder what happened there. So yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Well, either way, it doesn't matter. You know. You know, you can argue this all the way, whether it's gambling, not gambling, no one cares. The point is basically, you know, uh, there are elements of it. So yeah, imagine if Netherlands got all card packs replaced with selection packs. Oh shit, dude. Okay, let me buy a ticket straight to Netherlands. Now, if anything, if, any if anything, they might not get a single card pack. Oops. <laughs> yeah. Do you think NA gets 14-15? Possible. It's possible. But I mean, like, I don't think it will be the case if uh, you don't get the global honing buff. We'll see, I guess. Well, I don't know. Either way, it doesn't matter. The point is basically... Is there, like, a specific time for it? Well, the point is basically uh, Lost Ark will be making an appearance in TwitchCon right here. And then, like, people in Netherlands will be able to play without VPN anymore. So I guess Aero is good. 
A friend of mine in uh, Aero is taking care of my guild in EU and he's from Netherlands. So I guess like uh, he can play for free now. Mom joke streamer. Sharp shadow man. Thank you for the resub dude. Five months. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it man. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah well anyways. <laughs> Netherlands people rejoice. Speaking of, let's move on to the next topic right here. Uh, people were asking me to react to this yesterday right here. So yeah, 1460 item level is where the road ends for many. So yeah, I haven't read this yet, but yeah. You just need to be to download the game and you don't use it after. I know, I know. That's why like people can play it anyway. So yeah, so I think it's useless. Mm, I think it's different, basically. The point is basically now you don't have to tiptoe around it. You are now okay, you know. That's basically the point. Well, it doesn't matter. Because like people have played from outside of the... Up uh, what's the name? Region anyway to begin with. People from Asia play. Who cares, you know? Bots, uh, Chinese bots. Who cares, right? The point is basically, now you don't have to tiptoe if you're like in Netherlands. So yeah, I don't know. That's just how it is right there. Alright, anyways, moving on guys. 1460 is where the road ends for many. Let's see here by Chatsu. Boom, you've reached 1460. Okay, honing rates are abysmally low, costs are insane. I mean, it's just standard dailies and everything. You're barely upgrading and getting more powerful. Even if you're 1460, getting to 1490 is not really like that interesting anyway. Because like what makes you more powerful is your side gearing. You feel paywall. Paywall? To do what? What's, uh, what's the paywall? <laughs> what was the paywall about right here? Interesting, dude. Cause like uh, I would understand if it's like the Argos back in the day, but I mean like you you you're paywall for what exactly? I'm not sure as well. <laughs> I don't know right here. Vikas rate is very hard and you're struggling. You see others clearing it. Yes, some did K3 on normal, others on hard who were way over geared, they skipped the Medusa phase. Okay, a lot of people did it like on item level with no issue as well. You just need to like not be bad and have like proper gearing. This is where many quit and where others will be parking. Okay, surprise, even Korea, most of their player base at, after 4 years are in the 1440-1460 range. Huh? You mean this is alt item level, dude? So, yeah. If you can't take it anymore, well, things will get even way harder from now on. I'm not sure what's going on here. I'm not sure what he's thinking right there. The paywall for the 1475 Chaos Dungeon. Congrats right there. Wants to overgear Vikas? Oh, true! Based on his, like, saying right here, he cannot clear Vikas on eye level. Probably like a, a bit like bad at the game, I guess, you know. So, yeah, I don't know, man. Who or what overgear, they skip the Medusa phase. You don't need to overgear it to skip the Medusa phase. You just need to do proper damage. Oh, wait, but you guys think that like grudge is not like mandatory anyway. No wonder you're slow. Oops, and you guys see it. <laughs> so, I don't know. Honing success chance are so low and will get even lower, cost way more. You need more alts to cover, more time uh, and effort to put in, and you will rise up slowly. Like literally, if you're 1460 right now, you can play that character and only that character and you will reach 1490 by the time Brosiza comes out. So yeah, not at all. <laughs> you will be fine with it. So yeah, who people are crying so much about this Medusa? I don't know. <laughs> this one. Uh, Kakul Seiden is a 4-man raid, much more difficult than Vikas. I think it's the same. It's just his 4-man. And if you get like 4 men of like this kind of guy, then yeah, you're gonna be stuck right there. Because like uh, finding like eight decent players and finding four good players, four good players are harder to find. So yeah, and if you find like this guy, yeah, you're probably gonna get cucked right there on your like a uh, clown party. So yeah, won't be that overgive for it. So you will get wrecked, and a lot will depend on each player to be skilled and efficient to clear the raid. There we go. At least you know. <laughs> Same story with Bra Brawl Saza. Honing is even harder. Raid is much harder. You see the pattern. Actually, honing gets easier in Brawl Saza because you get a new gear. So it's actually easier. You go you go back to 10% instead of like 1%. So yeah, like Sun, thank you for the follow, man. Welcome, dude. So yeah, game is hard, man. A bit too hard, yeah. If only was like quality upgrade, we'll be gambling. Okay, well, this is like just not important. Anyway, if you're bored, well, been told not to rush, but no one listen. If you're bored of the entirety of the game uh, in a month or a few months of gameplay, yeah, you don't think you will be bored of one more boss? I mean, like, it's just the same. It's just new content. It's an MMO, though. Tell me an MMO that, like, if you're in the front line, you're just waiting for the uh, next content. Or is there an MMO that is, like, you know, machine gun raid every day? New raid every day? Well, I don't know what MMO that is, man, but it seems like that should be what we, we were playing. 
So yeah, one boss per week for 30 minutes will cheer your boredom. You are wrong. I mean, to be fair, <laughs> you're supposed to have like alls at this item level, you know. You're exhausted, tired, pressured, burnout, out, and can't do it anymore. And it won't get any easier but harder. The cries are getting louder, which was expected after Vikas. Which cries? Like this cries? Like this kind of cries? <laughs> this kind of cries? Getting louder? Is that our side there? That's why I expect the Global Hunting Bar will be released very soon to ease the pain. It is needed now. I think it should have been there from be uh, to begin with, but yeah. People that use forum different kind of different breed. Yeah, they are not the same. Yeah, they are not the same. They are not the same. So yeah, is speaking like Lost Ark is a job. I don't know. It depends, I guess. Or play at your own pace, enjoy all activities and uh, content in the game, play alls and have fun. If you feel like a game is homework that you have to be extremely efficient, perfect, you will quit and you will be miserable and you won't have fun. Lost Ark isn't rich and slow, painful climb to greatness. I mean, this person have like, you know, some ra uh, points that was right, some points that was like question mark as well. So yeah, first time watching catching you live, this one is golden, you know, free content, like some free content. <laughs> Free content. Here is the thing, right? You know, this is the thing right here. Lost Ark isn't race. It's slow, painful climb to uh, great greatness. It's not really painful unless you're inflicting that pain your to yourself. You know, if you're fomoing yourself right there, you know, then you're just masochist that's inflicting pain for yourself. What for? You don't need to. You know, you're just inflicting pain for yourself right there. So yeah, so play at your own pace and everything. You will catch up anyway as usual, basically. But there are like some wrong info as well. Brawl Shaza, honing is even harder. No, it gets easier in Brawl Shaza. That's where people start to catch up. So yeah. And then there is this part as well. You know, surprise. Even in Korea, most of their player base in four years are in the 45. There is actually an image of this one. I opened the image as well. This was the image. So this is the Loawa, uh, what's the name? Distribution of item level. Basically. Am I free to play? I am, yes. This is the distribution, and people were thinking like 1445, 1459, 1460, this is where people stopped, right? No, idiots, dude. This is basically characters. This is not the thing. This is our alts, yeah. And alt item level for us is 1445 to 1460, because we get access to Relic gear set. Now, so, of course, you're gonna see like most over here. If you see like about like half a year ago, most people are on the 1415, because that was alt I level back then. So, yeah, people and their 20 alts, basically. I can see the numbers I am old. Uh, I have to like uh, zoom it in basically. So you can see it right here. So yeah, so I'm at this uh, I'm at this part right now. So that that's me right there. That's my main. My alts right now are on this part. But then like uh, most people, right, they play like one character as a main and then they they play like, a lot of alts and the alts are usually at this item level. So yeah, you see like a lot of people at this item level basically. That's the alt right there. So, yeah, so that's basically the distribution. So when you say like 1460 is the where the road ends for many, yeah, for many alts more like, because the main is like pushing through. So this is just like wrong info right here, you know. Wrong info, pretty disingenuous, pretty stupid as well. You feel paywalled as well, that's pretty stupid. You feel paywalled to do what? To do Chaos Dungeon 1475? Damn, dude. If you feel paywalled for like 1475 Chaos Dungeon, whew, I don't know what to tell you, man. <laughs> Don't know what to tell you, dude. <laughs> I don't know, man. And then, like, Vikas raid very hard and you're struggling. I think, like, that depends on the player skill. So, yeah, skill issue. So, yeah, you see others clearing it and everything. So, yeah, that's not even what a paywall is. Yeah, not necessarily. Here's the thing, right? If you say back in the day when Argos released and then, like, you cannot be there, you say that it's a paywall, I can, I can like, get behind that one. But right now, you're 1460. And then you can do Vikas hard, right? And then you say you feel paywall. To do what? To do what exactly? So yeah, I don't know. Slow but surely climb. Yeah, there is no backward progression as well. I don't know. That's just how it goes right here. <laughs> yeah, I think like people, you're just FOMOing yourself. You're basically like, you know, slow painful climb. You're inflicting this pain to yourself. You didn't need to, but you just do it anyway. You stab yourself with a knife right there. So yeah. <laughs> 1445, 1475 chaos uh, feels absolutely the same. It is the same. Well, it's not necessarily the same. 1475 give you like an extra 20 redstone, an extra 60 blue, uh, st blue like a uh, guardian stone, and that's it. So no one cares. <laughs> it's basically the same thing, yeah. So that's basically how it goes right there. 
So this one is like you know he has like some like legit like concern like this like uh, what's the name the what's the name the global honing buff basically it should be like already there so yeah one boss per week 30 minute will kill your boredom you are wrong I mean like that's not entirely wrong as you guys are clearing like Vikas it will take like much much faster later on but I mean like the point is basically you should have like this honing buff already to begin with so you have your alts doing the same thing your main is doing should have been like that. But I mean like uh, they're de delaying it for some reason. I don't know how. Don't know why. Well, hopefully uh, early. Hopefully they get there early. Hopefully. But yeah. I'm rich with these extra stones. Rich bro. Rich rich. 1475. The next one is 1490 with Brawl Shaza. So yeah. When Brawl Shaza comes out right here. So yeah, And again. Honing becomes easier there. Rate is much harder. Mm, I don't think like the rate is much harder. Because like at the same time players get better as well. Unless uh, maybe you're in like a, uh, what's the name, bad seat region. So I guess like, uh, oof. if you're in bad seat region, uh, you know, you get like a harder rate. Am I right, boys? <laughs> Am I right? Am I right? <laughs> no chaos for a long time? I mean, like, it's the same thing. 1490 is the same thing anyway. So, yeah. Well, it's not the same thing. It gives you the new material for you to upgrade the Brawl Shaza gear. Hence why honing becomes easier in Brawl Shaza. <laughs> Vikas bug seat. Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> Classic right there. But yeah, that's how it goes right here. So yeah. Oh, this guy. Your screenshot isn't about concurrent players, but about different characters. Can be simply with the numbers shown on it. There's already people above like uh, 1500 level. Each weapon level gives something like 5 to 10% more DPS. Okay, this is like a lot, you know. That's not true at all. So yeah. But yeah, the old people understand. Glad someone understand it. Yeah, this one is better, I guess. This one is not really like a... Uh, this one is like correct. So yeah, 5 to 10, yeah, that's like a massive gain right there. God damn, dude. Bro says they have wrong seed bug on forums. You have wrong seed, dude. You know, you, you fight against two pro kill, bro. Not just one. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. This is like uh, the post right here. Again, this guy is like half and half, I guess, you know. He's half right, he's half uh, Papega as well. But I mean, like, it is what it is, you know. <laughs> it is what it is. He probably just doesn't know better. Selling good seed Vikas 5k. <laughs> Two people, one pro kill, good seed, yeah. And then like a one person, two pro kill right there. Bad seed right there. Reset the instance, boys. Reset the instance. <laughs> but yeah, this is like this a standard item level. If you check Loa, you will see this basically. This is like 1430 up until like a 1600. Most peop most character, not people, most character are on this item level. Like even like my alts right now that like, a, what's the name? Are on alt server and everything, they're on this item level. So yeah. That's just how it goes right there. But this is the one right here. That's like uh, the difference right there. So 1460 is where the road ends for many. I'm not sure about that one. Not really. Not true by, uh, for Koreans. Not really. For NAU, maybe. Maybe. Because like they get weeded out because like Vikas is like super hard, you know. Can't clear it. So maybe. But I mean like that's like a, that's just like a skill issue right there. Skill issue. 1460 when the bus starts for many the bus starts <laughs> yeah well i don't know it is what it is right there it is what it is can't make the set to progress <laughs> yeah either way just take your time man just take your time you know just take your time and you'll get there if you're 1460 right now i don't think you will even have any issue getting to 1475 by the time clown release and then going to 1490 by the time browser release i don't think you will have any issue with that so yeah <laughs> but yeah, anyways, that's like uh, this post right here. So yeah, Netherlands, dude. Netherlands, uh, you can play like a uh, what's the name? You can play, even though you're already playing anyway right now. But yeah, but this is the other one, the 1460, where the road ends for many. By the time my altar for city, I'll have beast row title, so I won't have trouble getting good groups. Maybe you know. But I mean, like you have beast row title, but then like you run like you know, uh, class engraving only. For Valton, I would kick you anyway. <laughs> so yeah, <clears throat> already 1480 and stop pushing uh, pushing my main two weeks ago. I mean you don't have to yeah. I mean like you can slow down over here, because like there is nothing for you to do like above like 1460. So uh, there is this part like you feel paywall to do what? You feel paywall to jack off right there. <laughs> yeah well anyways. <laughs> yeah anyways anyways this is the. React Andy boys, that's the one right here. 
So yeah, pretty interesting, I guess. How much harder is Vika's hard mode on eye level compared to Vika's hell mode? Not even the same fight. So yeah, where is Kukuharta level? 1475. Stop at 1470, still ready for 70 with free honing and bound material. Yeah, you just slowly get there. That's basically how it is. So, yeah, that's basically how it is. But yeah, anyways, guys, that's the post right here. 1460, 1460. He's not wrong, though, on, like, the part where, like, you know, uh, the part, like, where, like, it's boring and everything. Game is not exactly really that fun because, like, your routine is pretty boring. Namely, your whole spam and stuff like that, basically. So yeah, so I think this one should be released as a uh, ASAP basically, so that like your alts can do uh, Vikas and like a uh, uh, Valton. So it's not like 30 minute for like a week when there is new content. No, there is like more than that because you have multiple character. But yeah, anyways, guys, anyways, that's Ding Dong for today, guys. Ding Dong, Ding Dong, <laughs> Ding Dong, Ding Dong. But yeah, anyways, that's uh, the current one right here, the current state. Think new content is when it fu it gets fun, otherwise it's just repetition. Of course, yeah, but I mean like new content, you clear it, and then like the next week for you guys, Vikas right now, probably takes like an hour maybe or something like that. You clear it, and then you're just done. Same with Valton. Valton was like that as well. So yeah, what imp what's important is your like, you know, your daily routine. What do you do on the daily basis? Right now, you're doing Yoho and everything. That's not really that much fun. So yeah, but if your alts are doing uh, Valton Vikas, that would be more fun for you. There is gonna it is gonna be more retaining on the player base. But yeah. Valton's still a blast though, of course, yeah. I'm not saying Valton is not fun. But it's a blast for 20 minutes. That's the thing, Karajin. But if you have six alt at Valton, then you can do it for like one uh what's the name? Uh, 120 minutes, you know. Two hours of like Valton. That's much more better than like doing your Yoho. So yeah. But yeah, that's basically how it is. Did I ever get burned out while I started playing? Nope, never. Because I don't do the things that I don't need to. I don't like uh, collectibles, so I don't do it. I don't inflict pain on myself, dude, you know. I don't FOMO myself like a fucking idiot. I don't need to. For what? You know, I was two years behind. I caught up within like about, what, uh, three to four months. I caught up already. Well, not like fully, but I mean like I caught up already uh, for the content. Then after that, I was just like chilling. I, w I never like a uh, FOMOing myself right there, <laughs> so yeah. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, that's like uh, the post for today, man. That's Ding Dong react over for now. Let's move back, let's move back. <laughs>